what's poppin'? I don't know how close we are to this, but it's your girl, Tara Chantel. What is good? Y'all, it's my motherfucking birthday. Sorry, I'm not supposed to get spending on here, but it's my motherfucking birthday. I was supposed to not cuss. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. Happy birthday to me. I turned 25 years old, 24. Check myself before you wreck yourself. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. What is poppin'? It's your girl Tara Chantel, and today is my birthday. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday, happy birthday to ya. Huh. Cut the choir! <laughs> I'm just so excited to turn 25. It's a blessing to see 25 years old. And I just want to do a recap of this past year. It has been spectacular. It has been awesome. I don't have no complaints. It's, of course, we go through a lot of trials and tribulations, but that's a part of life, right? But you gotta find your way through it every step of the way. And I have came out stronger. You know, flex a little bit, flex for them, flex for them. But we came out stronger, we came out better, and we just came out great. I'm starting to tap into my true, authentic self and letting the world see who Tara Chantel really is behind closed doors. I don't care about the judgment. I don't care about the looks, the comments, the opinions. I am secure with self and I cannot wait to teach other people how to be secure with themselves as well. This year has taught me to take control of my own destiny. I created, produced, and wrote Royal Purpose. So, you know, y'all got to check that out. The trailer is up now. So, check it out. Show love. And we are still on the go with Take the Lead podcast as well. So, I'm in this mind frame of not waiting for handouts. You feel me? I'm going to get what is mine. I'm going to get what I deserve. And everything that is mine has my name on it already. I just have to walk into it. And I'm going to continue to go after it. I'm going to continue not to wait for someone to green light my career. And I'm just going to do it myself. And I feel like I have the potential to. And I have the ability to. And the resources. We are in 2020. What are you waiting for? You waiting for someone to save you? You waiting for Captain Saber? No, don't do it. You are wasting your time. And we only got one life to live. It's so much time on the clock. We don't know when the curtain's gonna close. So do what you wanna do. If you have an idea, take action on it. And I have these magnificent ideas that I just wanna unleash and share to the world i have so many gifts i want to share to the world and sometimes i can feel very overwhelmed and sometimes i feel like i'm not doing enough but i have to just be still and be thankful and be in gratitude at all times because i know everything is going to work out and i try to take things day by day and we're going to be good at the end of the day. And this year has taught me that I'm still figuring it out. I thought I wanted to do this. I thought I wanted to do that. Turns out that's all a lie. Turns out <laughs> I'm still figuring out my purpose. And I think I'm constantly going to figure out what I'm meant to do here. But I feel like I'm walking towards my purpose more and more each day and I'm making process so as long as you're making process you are in the right direction you have to continue to let God lead your steps every day 
and don't let the ego get in the way like thinking you know everything because that's not the case. I truly don't have all the answers. I truly don't know where I will end up next year, but I'm just thankful for each and every opportunity that God has blessed me with, the people that he has placed in my life, my family, and I just know I have a bright future if I continue to stay on this path that I'm headed. I also wanna touch bases on with having self-discipline i have been very disciplined in this whole year i i don't party i don't go clubbing i stay and cre i stay home and create today is my birthday and you see i'm like <laughs> youtubing like i'm constantly trying to betterment my career because I know the career choice that I'm doing it's in the entertainment wherever I'm supposed to be in the entertainment industry that is where it is is at I'm still trying to figure that out really disciplined I'm really focused nobody can get me off track and that's how I know I'm gonna get far because I got this mindset to win and when you have this winner mentality you cannot lose. People might try to come in your way as distraction, but you gotta, you gotta dodge them every step of the way. Don't let them get you off course. Don't let them take you off your hook. Don't take things personal out here because everybody has their own perception of you. So don't let you, don't get so offended when someone don't like you. Nine times out of ten, it ain't about you. But continue to share love, continue to share light, and all I can do is be me. You can love me, you can hate me, you can relate to me, but all I know how to do is be me. And the more and more as I continue to be myself, I realize, like, I'm cool as fuck. Like... Excuse my friends, but I'm cool as F, man. Like, I really feel like I'm super cool. I'm super down to earth. I'm easy to talk to. I'm easy to relate to. I'm accessible. If you ever just want to hit up and talk to your girl, I'm here. I want to talk. I want to communicate. And I realize that in my career choice, I want to get paid to have a conversation. I want to get paid to just talk and so I'm just continuing trying to figure this thing out figure which direction I am gonna go in and trust me yesterday I was just crying in gratitude because like I know God got my back so much and I know I'm gonna be good in my career and I and I and I at the end of the day I really can't wait to like look back at this in a year or two and just see how far I came and how much I accomplished that's why you have to document your life and write down your goals journal and just to see how far you have came and just to show the growth because it is all about the growth. We have accomplished so much from producing our own short film to being the creator of our own podcast. And it's all about creating your own reality. I see so much for me as an entertainer, an actress, a producer, a writer. The ball is in your court. Do whatever you wanna do. Nobody's holding you back but you. So get to it. Talk that talk. Be about your business. Don't make no excuses and do it yourself. Y'all, thank y'all so much for tuning in. Hey, it's your girl, Tara Chantel, the Libra goddess in this place to be. 1016, that's the date a star was born. And I can't wait to see y'all at the top, baby. Let's go.